Well, we need a canvas top for this chuck wagon and that's what we're going to go through the process of how I build these wagon tops. Well, to build this top, I'm going to use 10 ounce cotton duct canvas. I'm going to start out with a 10 foot square piece. This particular canvas came in 5 foot widths, so I'm going to sew the two together to make our 10 foot square to begin with. Now before you build these tops, it's a good idea to run them through the washer or even just soak them down with the hose and let them dry, because they're going to shrink quite a bit. This 10 by 10 shrunk down to 9.5 by 9. I'm going to begin by putting these two halves together to make my 10 by 10 or 9 by 9.5 by doing my modified style of a flat filled seam. Well down the side of this wagon top I want three layers of thickness so this is where I'm going to sew my loops that will attach it down the side. So I want this reinforced three layers thick. On each end there's going to be rope threaded through as a drawstring that will cinch us down both around the front and the back bolt. I'm going to do this with a 2 inch hem.
Now you can do these canvas wagon tops with grommets. I really don't like them because they aren't the old style. So I'm going to sew some loops and place one at each bow. Well, I'm going to use a quarter inch Cecil rope. I don't like these ends fraying and I don't like them tied up with tape, so I'm going to braid them back on themselves.
Now there's quite a variety of methods of attaching these canvas tops to the wagon side. Oftentimes you'll see maybe hooks fabricated or sometimes a slat attached down each side. I'm going to use these old wagon box top irons and refabricate them into a ring assembly that will easily tie these tops to. There's also a wide variety of methods of tying these ropes and drawstrings. I'm going to use a real simple hitch, it's called a climbing half hitch. It works really well and it's really pretty secure. Well these wagon tops aren't all that difficult to build. It does help if you have a big work table to kind of work this fabric around. And when I tie the loops on this boot patch machine really is a big help. It does take kind of a little heavier machine. Sometimes you're sewing through nine different layers of canvas. Anyway this is kind of how I put wagon tops together. Once again, thanks for watching.